opening paint. To open the paint window on a computer, follow these steps. Move the mouse pointer on the start button and click on it. The start menu is displayed. Click on all programs. Click on accessories. Click on paint. The paint window gets displayed on the screen. Parts of paint window A paint window has the following four main parts. Paint button It provides the basic commands for a file operations. That is, file, open, save, save as, print, exit, etc. Quick access toolbar it contains a set of commands that are specified by the application or selected by the user. Example, save, print, undo, etc. The ribbon. It is a strip containing the sets of tools placed in various groups under several tabs. That is, home, image, tools, etc. Drawing area. It is the white area where you can draw and color the pictures and drawings. Tools section Different types of tools are used in paint for performing different functions. Let's learn about some tools available on the home tab. Fill with color tool, text tool, brushes. Click on this part for accessing all the available brushes, magnifier tool, eraser tool, pencil tool. Color section. By using colors tool, we can choose the foreground and background colors. To choose the foreground color, click on the color 1 button for the foreground colors and choose the color from the colors palette. To choose a background color, click on the color 2 button for the background colors and choose a color from the colors palette. Edit colors helps us to select the colors of our choice and create custom colors in the colors box. To create custom colors, click on the edit colors button and edit colors window will be shown. Click on the desired color and click on the Add to Custom Colors button. Click on the OK button. Making a drawing. To make a drawing in paint, we use the Home tab on the ribbon. We can see different tools on it. Let us learn about some of these tools. Pencil Tool this tool looks like a real pencil which is used to draw freehand drawings on the drawing area. The steps to use the pencil tool are Click on the Home tab. In the Tools group, click on the Pencil tool. The cursor changes into Sign. Select any color from the Colors box by clicking. Press the left mouse button and drag the mouse on the drawing area, we can make the pencil thinner and thicker as per your requirement. The steps to set the pencil thickness are Click on the size list box. A list appears containing four black lines options, thinner to thicker. Select the required thickness of the pencil, pencil tip to be precise. To make the drawing, Changing the background. In MS Paint, by default, we get a white background, but we can change it according to our requirement. Solid color background. The steps to change the color of the background are Click on the Fill with Color tool. Click on the required color from the colors box. Click in the drawing area to fill the selected color. Textured color background. For a textured colored background, follow the steps given below. Click on the required color from the colors box. 
brush up a small area. Repeat the above steps with few other colors. Click on the square selection tool from the image section. Select a small part of the colored area. Press the shift key and drag the mouse through the working area to get a textured background. Erase tool. You must have used an eraser to erase a mistake while drawing in a drawing book. You can use eraser in paint also. The steps to use the eraser tool are Click on the home tab. In the tools group, click on the eraser tool. Drag across the drawing canvas on the drawing which you want to erase. Brushes tool Brushes tool are used to draw different thin and thick lines. This can be done by selecting the different brush tip of your choice. The steps to use the brushes tool are Click on the home tab. In the tools group, click on the arrow of the brushes list box. Select the required brush type. Select any color from the colors box by clicking. Press the left mouse button and drag the mouse on the drawing area to draw the painting. Text tool The text tool is used to type the text in your drawing area. You can give titles to your drawing using this tool. The steps to use the text tool are On the home tab in the tools group, click on the text tool. Click anywhere on the drawing area. A new tab with the name text appears in the ribbon. Here we can set the font type, size, color and background for text. Type the required text in the text box. Click outside the text box after completion. Different options available in the text tab are shown below. Font name. Click here to see the drop down list of fonts. Bold, Italic, Underline, Strike Through. Font Size. Click here to see the drop-down list of font sizes. Text Background. There are two options of text background. Transparent Background. This option is used to keep the background of the text area transparent. Opaque Background. This option is used to fill the background of the text area. The steps to set the text background are After selecting the text tool for typing, click on the required option of text background in the background section on the home tab. Shapes tools Paint provides different types of ready-made shapes ranging from traditional shapes like line, rectangle, ellipse, triangle and arrows to fun and unusual shapes like heart, lightning bolt, etc. If we want to make our own custom shape, we can use the polygon shape. The steps to use the shapes tools are Click on the home tab in the shapes group. Click on the required shape. Select the options from the outline and fill list boxes if required. Select any color from the colors box by clicking, press the left mouse button and drag the mouse on the drawing area to draw the selected shape.